I've gotten files from a few students uh, that were named things like index.html.html. You can see in this example here. Um, and it probably did not look that way on your computer. So if you're getting trouble with this, this is, this is actually a really strange um, problem to have. Um, and, it be, and it comes as a default setting on a lot of Windows computers. So let me show you how to change this particular setting and what it does. Um, if you go to your control panel, and this works all the way back to Windows XP, um, and there should be a folder options command. Um, if you can't see this, you might be in category view, and you'll have to switch over to one of the icon views. Anyway, in folder options, there's an option called view. And one of the default options that's clicked, usually when you get Windows, is called hide extensions for known file types. Now what this does is it hides the extension. It's still there, but it's hidden. So when you go to create a file, you can just call it file or whatever you would like. Um, and even if you try to change the extension on it, it doesn't actually change the extension. What it's doing is it's adding that to the file name. You're actually allowed to put as many periods and dots as you would like inside the file name. But if I turn that option back off, you'll see that the extension is actually still there. It's just being hidden. So if you have the extension turned on, uh, hide extensions turned on, you're actually creating one level deeper extension uh, than you need. So just a quick recap. Go to Control Panel, Folder Options, View, uh, uncheck hide extensions from known file types.